fascinated by the story itself, but the real draw was really Scott. You know, I've always wanted to work with him. We've been friendly. Uh, I've seen each other in passing over the years, probably for the last 20 years. Um, and I've always been a huge fan of his. And I was actually in the middle of shooting another movie. And they said I would only have five days between films. And the first person I wanted to check in with was my wife, just to let her know uh, what a unique opportunity it was to play this particular part and also to work with with a, a guy that I admire so much. So, uh, And then when I read the script, obviously I was pleasantly surprised because it wasn't the kind of part that I normally get to play. Uh, Ridley said, you know, no guns, no teddy bears. And uh, I didn't beat anybody up either, which, is, which was nice. You know, proper suits and, uh, you know, a uh, well-educated guy who uh, does a lot of interesting things for Mr. Getty. When I started researching Fletcher Chase, I didn't find pretty much any information on him. Uh, Ridley was uh, able to access some things, not, not that much, but, uh, you know, he was, uh, you know, Head of the crew team at Harvard, you know, former uh, frogman, Navy SEAL, CIA agent, uh, ran an oil business, um, and uh, he was advising other oil companies when Mr. Getty realized how resourceful he would be, and, uh, and he ended up working for, for Getty full-time, uh, for Getty Oil, and also for uh, Getty as his personal head of security. They had this wonderful relationship where, you know, I think uh, Fletcher Chase really admired and looked up to and was inspired by, by uh, J. Paul Getty. And then as he realized the severity of the situation, uh, what the real stakes were with Paul uh, and, the, and the mafia, that, you know, he would obviously do everything to protect Getty's money. But he knows once it's, the situation is this serious, it's, it's time to pay. To see a guy and, and to be a guy who's always aspired to make films uh, and both in front of him behind the camera and get to learn from him, uh, it was kind of like a, uh, you know, a win-win for me because I get to A, work with him, but I also get to learn from him and kind of observe him.